there are a lot of different squashes at the farmer's market. This is an acorn squash. Here is a butternut squash. These squashes have very hard skins, so you can store them for several weeks at home. Now, let's make our Mediterranean squash stew. Let's start off with the butternut squash that I got at the farmer's market. And for this recipe, we're only going to need half. Cut it right in half again, much easier this time. And scrape it clean. Peel the outside of the butternut squash with a peeler. Cut the squash into one half inch cubes. There you go. About one half of a butternut squash will give you about three cups of cubed squash. Let's put together the sauce now. I have about one and three quarter cups of diced tomatoes. And that equals one can of diced tomatoes. Add one tablespoon of lemon juice to it. And one tablespoon of brown sugar. Okay, that's one teaspoon of mustard. And one teaspoon of oregano and a teaspoon of salt. I'm going to mix that all together. Now I'll heat two teaspoons of oil, add one half cup of chopped onion, and two cloves of chopped garlic. Stir that for about three minutes. Keep stirring over medium high heat, and don't let the garlic turn brown or it will taste bitter. Add my butternut squash to the mixture now. And add my sauce. Put the lid on and keep it on a medium high heat and let that cook for 15 minutes. Take this off the stove right now and stir in two cups of chopped kale and two cups of cooked rice. If this becomes a little bit dry, just add some water to it. And I'm going to put that back on the stove top now with the lid on it and let that cook for another five minutes. And I believe this is ready. Look how beautiful that looks. And that's it. That's how you make a Mediterranean squash stew. Some other ideas for squash are stuffed squash, mashed squash, and roasted squash with potatoes.